off down to Bailey's Beach to go get some mussels hopefully, it's a super low tide, I think it's what they call king tides and stuff, and uh, we've got about an hour and a half before bottom of the tide, catch you there. Well here we are Trevs, we're at Bailey's Beach, and we're going to head up north to the bluff, which is about 25 k's away. Yeah, I can see why you've got to be back in the <laughs> as quick as mm. you get about 30 minutes, 20 to 30 minutes slack water, eh? Yeah. I don't even think we'd be halfway yet. Here's the time. Oh, it's it just coming up 20 to 8. Your time? 20 to 7 my time. <laughs> so it's we'll still be. it's still 20 to 7 my time. <laughs> Should do because it's a minus 300, which is another foot lower yeah. than normal. But the next tide is 200 lower, so we've probably got the best day to come up here and get these little lures. Nah, I don't think so. It's still going in. We've got another, we've got just under half an hour to low tide. Some muscles in. Yeah, of yeah, there are here. Is a oh, Ranga Beach, I think this place is called. That... Yeah, now if there's houses here, they must have a freaking access. It can't be all flying in or anything. <laughs> Candid camera. Look at your small letters. They're not very big. There's a limpet if you want to eat him. No. Hey right, Trevs, here we are. Lots of water here, Trevs. Might get wet backswords, I think. The mussels are real small. But you can only take what's here, eh? And there's no size limit on them. And we've got a very short window in which to get them. Very short window indeed. Well, here comes some more water. Trevs will have to wait for this to pass. Of course, we could get very wet. Seen some great fishing spots around here, mate. Well, I'll tell you what, man, there's some good holes around here. Not just here, but further back there in the beach. Excellent stuff. We might have a bit of a surf cast here. Right, eh, Trevs? Just gonna bandy keep these little fellas, I think, as they're um plus these are tiny mate, I feel like a burglar taking these. But there's nothing else we can do. I wanna get this one here, mate. It's a bit bigger than the other ones. Well boys going up there to get some more mussels. <laughs> 
they're only quite small, but hey, it's a pretty popular place too from what I've heard. And uh, we can only take what we can get, eh? Only small troops. But there's not much we can do, eh? we we'll go and catch up to Boyd. Out here collecting our kai, eh? Oh, that's just an old shelf. Fooled me. Now that there is still quite small, he's not four inches across, eh? Well, that's what we used to do them when I was on the muscle boats. But this one here is heavy. That means he got a bit he got a bit of guts inside him, mate, eh? Good stuff. Brilliant trees. Look at that boy over there, eh? Actually good to be out here doing it again for a change trees, eh? Haven't done anything for a while. Had a bit of a upset down home, so I came up to Boy's place, eh? Eh? I apologise in advance for the sound quality. So this is an Osmo Action 1, and the sound quality on this is not that good, eh? Yeah, they're quite small, eh? Oh, you can only get what's there. They're probably more out there, eh? The bigger ones here. Yeah, yeah, that'd be great, wouldn't it, eh? Plenty of fish tucker here, though. Oh, yeah. Fish like eating mussels. Fish and chips and Yeah, yeah. Oh, look at that. You've been out here five minutes and you're already bleeding. Attracting shit. Oh, mate, yeah, no, I think I'm notorious for that, eh? Look at that, done immortal again, see? I'm always doing most things. Father God says the seas will not go past his commandments, so Father, I'll just ask that you command them to go back out of it for a while. Look at that boy, running away with a man's muscles. <laughs> yeah. Gee, these are small. Talk about robbing the cradle. Big ones are further out, but every time we go out there, it tends to get swamped. Gee, they're small, eh? Right? Freaking heck. Almost embarrassing, mate. Yeah, the clubbies get thrown around in the waves too much, eh? The sea loves your gun boots, boy. Get your uh, water shoes next time, eh? Look at this tracker over here, Ted. The only person I've ever known to come muscling with gum boots on. <laughs> Not just any gum boots, but red men.
just going to have to get what we can and scarper. We've only got a small window here eh, to get these things, man. You can't even get out to the deeper water to get them because it's too rough. I don't know how many there, but there certainly wouldn't be a hundred for the two of us, that's for sure. Some big gooies to go over before we get to the truck. It's way up there. Trips. And that there, as you can see today, is now our bush kitchen. 98 mussels, Trevs. Plus the ones we ate. And one dead one. There you go, Trevs. Look at this, eh? Mmm, yummy yums. Straight out of Bailey's Beach. Grows hairs on the chest. And that fella there, that's my eldest boy, he needs some hair on his chest too, Trev, so he's going to eat lots of them. There, there, Trev, is the chef onto it with the mussels. That's that fella right there. He's handsome, he's almost as handsome as me. But you can keep trying. <laughs> and these here have panko crumbs on them. Yummy yums. It's the Finnish McCoy. And this is the end result of it. Mm. Mm, beautiful. <laughs> 